What's up guys, welcome back to another video. So last video y'all seen we did clean out the shed and everything. But um oh it's hot. But actually so if you remember I don't think I ever videoed it, but we uh we made a stand for the pit bike when we had it. And now we got the dirt bike, pit bike stand. They don't really uh sit on, so now this is just a seat. So today we are going to be building another one. I've already got everything cut. I was like, you know what, let's just make this a video. I already got one little part made, but uh, we're gonna go ahead and throw you on the time lapse and um, go ahead and get building this, so enjoy. So we got this one, which is the pit box. And after building this, I kind of like thought, I actually forgot I put those in there. Jeez, I really did think about this one a lot more than I thought. But like, yeah, I put that in there. So that's how it was held together. And like, it, yeah, it's loose. But then I just built this one. Okay. It's got this support, this one. And then it's got the legs, it's got those to hold. Little, to keep it from moving back and forth at the same time it's got these two supports and if it was me i would say that's a pretty high up difference i might actually start making chairs if y'all would like to see me start making chairs like or just seats like this but a little taller i will actually start making them might even start selling them it ain't gonna be the prettiest thing but I might start i might spray paint this one like i did that one I spray painted this one with the last little bit of can I had, but I might spray paint that one. But we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna try and see what it will look like setting it under the dirt bike. Oh, okay, sorry. Well, I got this extra one. I didn't know that I wouldn't need it. So, like, I built it. This is the first one I think I built. So, I might put it. I might put this one on it. And just have it sitting there as a support. Well, that's all. I think it looks pretty good. I think it looks pretty good, actually. Like, I don't know. It looks somewhat okay, but... And then you got that front support right here that I can just pull out. This one might be like, I might take this and build something out of it, but that one would have went right there and it would have been four, but I was like, we'll just go with three supports. But after all, I think it looks pretty good. 
Yeah. The bike, the back one's off the ground. The bike don't move side to side. Oh, it does move back, but it's gonna do that. But right. that front support was actually helping, I guess. But yeah, I think I did a pretty good job on this, actually. So yeah, that was a short little video. We gotta clean all this up and everything. Yeah, I gotta clean all this up, put it back to where it was, and all this, and yeah, so y'all, get on, like, subscribe, comment, and I guess we'll catch you on the freaking next one. Thank y'all for subscribing, and whoever's all subscribed, but thank y'all. Also, don't forget to let me know if you need any of those down. It's a 2000 Honda Rancher seat, and it's a, it's a seat. An airbox lid and a gas tank with a gas cap. So let me know if you need those. And also, I have an extra gas cap for I don't know what. It didn't fit on any of these, nor did it fit on that. So I don't know what it fits on. But yeah, we'll cover the price. But y'all go down, like, subscribe, comment. And, um, ooh, that's the reflex. We'll catch you on the freaking next one.